The Mars family want to wish you and yours a very Merry Christmas this year. Uh, it's been 20 years we've been doing this, and as a lot of you know, Jake was in kindergarten when we founded Peaceful Valley. Josh was in first grade. Now Jake's got his MBA and two bachelors. Josh is in his last semester of law school. And we have rescued literally tens of thousands of donkeys. And it, to me, it's a very rewarding life. Uh, I, I feel like we've really accomplished a lot. Uh, every year we do more and more and more, and I don't see that in me. But what I wanted to do is I wanted my family to share with you what they've gotten from being part of Donkey Rescue. Jake? Um, well, you definitely learn to uh, find something that you really care about, and you pursue it with everything you have, make sure that um, whatever it takes to reach that end goal, to, you know, save that donkey, to pass that test, to get that job, like, you, or even to keep the job, you just give your 100% every day and you uh, keep chasing that dream until you finally have it. Sure. Yeah, I don't, I don't think a lot of kids get to devote their life to something that big early on. And so that's something unique that we kind of have. And the donkey rescue has always been my identifier. It's been my entire life, and my life is better because of it. So it's definitely affected us for the better. And you know, you don't really think about it growing up. You know, how is this changing my life, or like, who am who am I because of this? And but you know, it's it's given us drive and work ethic and focus and driven us to bigger, better things. And that's really interesting too because did you think as you were standing there in the mud and you were standing there in the heat or you were laying electrical pipe on the Tehachapi Ranch, all the things you had to do, did you think that you would look back at some point and see the value of what was going on and what you got from it? I mean at the time it was just a lot of work and it was really hot or it was really cold or, but now, I mean look where you're at and the work ethic that you learned and the commitment you learned I think has brought you or has helped you get to where you are. Now. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. Um, my personal statement, which is something required for law school applications, it's basically a two-page story about yourself. Mm -hmm. My entire two pages was about the donkey rescue. The donkey rescue is three different lines on my resume. You know, I bring it up in every interview I've ever had, and any conversation I have with somebody, it usually comes up. It's it's who I am, and so there's it's definitely just been a giant part of my life and kind of identified me as my life has gone through. Yeah, and I always find it being a talking point because we officially started working for the rescue when I was in like sixth grade. Mm -hmm. So having a little section of my resume that says since like 2006, they're like, well, wouldn't you have been like 13 at the time? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it happened. Yeah. I got, you know, so. Yeah, that's just when you started getting a little bit of a paycheck, but. Mm -hmm. We started in well, 2000. We all started in 2000. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. But, you know, it's that thing that we always say everything shapes you, you know. And yes. this, this has definitely shaped a big part of your life and your personality. And, mm -hmm. so. so, from our family to yours, we want to wish you a very Merry Christmas. And we uh, look forward to whatever the Donkey Rescue brings to us next year. Y'all be good.